All right, all right, ladies and gentlemen, citizens of the Empire, we are back. Cora wanted to talk to us, so let's go see what she wants. You have AVP outstanding, Pathfinder. Thank you, Wait, Sam. Lexi, your dad was Turian? That knock, explains. knock. They aren't just conquerors or slavers. The Ket turn everything you are to their advantage. Worst kind of enemy. The one that makes you fight your own people. That's what Jal faces every day, now that we know the truth. Friends, neighbors, all changed. And they're loyal to what changed them. You're pretty worked up about this. Kandros wants strategies for handling the Ket. I talked with Drac, putting ideas together. Expand our guerrilla tactics, get Angaran military advisors, research exaltation. Just, I don't know. Wish your dad could give me his take. You don't need his take. Dad would have helped. If his experience fell through, he always had smarts to fall back on. And now, Nasira, your father, they always had a plan I could follow. Without one, it's too easy for people to get hurt. Like now. The Initiative's plans are shot, and people die because of it. We're flying blind. It'll take years to put all the pieces back together. Our biggest headache is the Ket. Work goes on, I guess. Sarissa will have a strategy. Just need to find her and the other Asari. It'll be good to have certainty again. Trust me, you're capable of coming up with your own strategy, so are we. We can do this. Alright, what were we gonna do? Oh, yeah. Let's go, um... Go to Aya. Well, we got other stuff at the email. Poker awaits. Gil wants to meet us at the uh, Nexus bar. And Garden Resistance. Some of your scouts have returned. Interesting information about the cat. I'm certain to intrigue you. I'm on Vold. We'll, uh, so we'll Kalo, see about Who's that woman I keep seeing you with on the Nexus? Uh oh. What? Whom? You're always short of credits after we come back. Is it because of her? It's complicated, Subi. Uh oh. Old Arbit is steady. Alright, um, let's go back to the galaxy map. Here's Aya. I can feel the Scourge's drag on the ship. At least it keeps Aya hidden. <laughs> Yeah, that's, that's real good. For us, at least. Oh, nope, that's not Aya. Stars and skies light our way. Stars and skies light our way. She knows how to play a crowd. <laughs> She's the most high. Welcome home. I never thought I'd see it again. Without the resistance and the pathfinder, I wouldn't be here. It was a group effort. effort. We made a good team. We freed more than just the Moshai. And the Pathfinder killed a Ket leader. We have a lot to celebrate. I promise to lead the Pathfinder to Aya's vault. Take as much time as you need. You're still recovering. Take your time. I'm not going anywhere. Not without our help. I'll prepare the vault for your arrival. A shuttle will bring you to me when it's ready. Right. Thank you, Moshai. 
We've been alone against the Ket for too long. You've proven it doesn't have to be that way. It's time we discussed an alliance between our people. We're happy to make room for you on the Nexus. We'll provide an embassy here as well. Our city is open to you. Join us. Excellent. Well done, Jol. Report for reassignment. I need to stay with the Pathfinder. He's welcome. Jal has already become a valued member of my crew. Of course he has. I see the benefit. Request granted. I need to file a mission report. Don't leave Aya without me. Yeah, we wouldn't do that. Take a shuttle to the Aya's vault. Uh, there was somebody I need to talk to out here. You came back? I have bad news. Your supplier, Keldo. The cat got him. Thank you for confirming how he died. You have his supplies? Supplies. Your friend is dead. Don't you care? I grieved for Keldo before I sent you to find his body. He fought for the resistance. Died for it. We still need what he promised. The cat had your weapons. I got them back. Yes. All of them. And Keldo's killer's dead. This is good. You're honest, Pathfinder. Reliable. I'll tell Afra you did well. Are we friends yet? Look. How many more of these tests do I have to pass? We don't trust outsiders. But maybe we can work with you. Need to get the weapons where they belong, but... Keldo would want me to help you. I have things you can use, and I want to see your credits for myself. Trade? You'll accept them? Think I'm getting the better deal. All you walk away with is a number. True. But who knows what that number will be worth someday. My inventory is open to you. Anything you need. Sweet, let's do it. Let's see what he has. Disruptor ammo. Send me your ammo. Okay, we can definitely come to him for that. Get alloy. Okay, so he's a good supplies vendor. Oh, wait a minute. My ship's almost here. Last chance to trade before I go. All right. Let's see what you've got. I just wanted to sell the salvage. Goodbye. <laughs> now let's go check out inside. Hmm. Interesting. Oh, wow. Jesus, look at this. It's a beautiful place. And there's side quests. I never thought I'd see the Moshai again, least of all thanks to you. Welcome to the marketplace. I am Arbiter Renarv. I enforce correct contact between merchants and customers, resolving any disputes. As the first outsider to enter the city, you are ignorant of our laws. We should change that. Uh, judgment and punishment? Who decides what happens to people who break the law? It depends on the grievance. I settle minor offenses right here. More serious ones require a tribunal. Okay, trade laws. Where I'm from, the biggest trade law is don't cheat. Is it different here? I suspect we define cheating differently. What is unfair changes based on perspective. Okay. I don't want to cause any trouble. How do I learn your laws? I'll transmit a full readout. Familiarize yourself with the contents. Personal responsibility is a core foundation of our society. We expect it from everyone. Calling, Understood. Please visit my colleagues in the governor's office and the resistance headquarters. They'll teach you about our culture and what it means to walk freely among us. Your understanding is critical. It would be unfortunate if you accidentally violated our laws. Okay, sounds good. We got an extra uh, task here. Your credits are as good as anyone else's. Don't start any trouble and we're fine. Understood. I can do that. Good to hear. 
What else you got? Bunch of stuff. Minerals and whatnot. She doesn't sell. Wait, she sells what? No. Goods for the home, tools for the field, supplies for all. Ryder. What are you up to, Vetra? Doing okay? <laughs> Who knew saving a respected member of Angaran society would open so many doors? I've been talking to some of their traders, seeing if we can work things out. We have to be careful not to trade away too much of what the Nexus needs. Trust me, I'm running everything by cash. Alright, sounds good. New clientele is always welcome here. Have a look, I'm sure you'll find something to your taste. Uh, that's what they all say. The sales pitch is good, but it's the follow-through that matters. <laughs> I'll let my inventory speak for itself. Sounds good. Some nice armor pieces. That's... Oh, he only has that one set. Okay. A resistance flyer. I'm not selling to aliens. That's racist. But I can't make you sell anything. Materials. They let you pass the gates. Huh. That a problem? Can I shop here or should I go elsewhere? Well, you did rescue the Moshai. Have a look, see if there's anything you want. Automatic firing system. Burst fire system. Magellan generator. Shield booster. Shield bypass. Good. Okay. Um. Oh, hello. What's that Restaurant? freaky thing? I was there when you landed. Watched did you get escorted through the city? Probably looked funny. Bet that was a sight. You were an unexpected outsider. Not really a laughing matter. Uh, this fruit. I've never seen fruit like this before. What are these? <coughs> Haripo. Sweet with a little bite. Sometimes if I'm lucky, I have a few Kiloa or Elmok. Is fruit scarce here? In this form, yes. Very expensive. If you buy a Paripo from me, it means you have something to celebrate. It's a luxury, meant to be shared with friends and family. I'll get moving. All right. Makes sense. Not something you buy just to try. I can't be sure what exaltation really means. Exaltation is just another word for how to kick killers. Okay. And if you're wrong, if we've been killing for them without realizing it? I saw a cat up close when they attacked. It was nothing like our people. Uh, all cat aren't alike. They want to confuse you. Well, Certainly, they're probably not all alike, but they intend to confuse you. The cat weaponize their victims to make you hesitate. And when the cat begin to exalt your people, what will you do then? Thank you for that. Insight, Pathfinder. The issue facing us is complex. Come, my friends. Deliberate with me. Okay, that was a very short conversation. Anything else around here? Can I go through here? Repos oh, it's a museum. Ryder, hey, PB. They've got amazing Remtech research going on here. Can I? There we go. You know, the more I interact with the Angara, the more I feel for them. Especially with what we know about exaltation, I can't imagine. Believe me, I'm pissed off on their behalf. You nailed it. That's exactly how I feel. We need to make things right. Yeah, we can do that by killing Cat. Okay. Wait, where is this other, um... There's a side mission here. 
to do. Where is the side? Oh, it's, it's right by the other one. All right, we'll check that out. Oh, I went the wrong way. I meant to go towards the resistance, uh, resistance headquarters. Hello. Can can we can we speak? Okay, guess not. Heard you were coming. I prepared a date pattern our laws regarding war. Learn them. Okay, I already did. Is there anything down here I can uh, scan? Wait. Guess not. Okay, never mind. Back towards the other one. And that also has a side mission with it, so we can kill two birds with one stone. Oh, oh my. Okay. You first. Arbiter Renav told me to expect you. I prepared a data pad detailing our laws. Read it fully. Okay. Pathfinder, as you can imagine, your arrival raised concerns from I's people. Yeah, I don't blame them. What's going on? It'll take a long time to trust strangers again. Which is why they want the Nexus to listen to them. We've set up terminals in the city so people can leave messages for your people on the Nexus. I'd appreciate if you take a look and forward their communications to your people. Okay. That door is closed. Thought I tried to activate the uh, side quest. All right, let's go around and do it. Okay, let there be unity. Long enough to come in that when I get lost, but huh. Shoot peace and good fortune. No one will read this at all. This message will never be read by the Pathfinder, much less uh, reach the Nexus. We're so desperate for allies against the cat uh, that we're willing to make the same mistake with new aliens. Uh, this little little stunt by the governor won't change anything we may as well be screaming into the wind let's forward this unedited we're probably gonna f end up forwarding them all unedited but still oh come on Thank you. Go home. Yep, used to hearing that. Uh, if you come in peace and friendship, whatever that means. Okay. Fresh powder So a mix of uh, a mix of opinions thus far. Excuse me. Pardon me. I'm gonna do this one up here. Probably shouldn't, because that that means now I gotta backtrack. But fuck it, I'm already here. Why are you here? Questions. Keep off her Uh I heard you were granted permission to land on her Varl. I filed a complaint with the governor. Uh, that is one of our most sacred places for outsiders. Even the cat keep their distance. Well, they're probably terrified of the place, maybe. All right, one last one. I'm surprised that the cat keep their distance from anywhere. <laughs> they don't seem like the kind to do so. But honestly, they might not even know about it for sure. They, like, 
even a, in a galactic war situation, there's a there's a possibility that you know about a planet, but don't really know about a planet. Right here. Liam and Drac. Real change in tone after that care facility. Half the Angara are thankful. Half are even more suspicious. Let's try not to make it worse. Don't worry about me. They're busy glaring at Cora for some reason. Let me tell you about Cora, really? Uh oh, Drax telling stories to the bartender. Helping the Moshi opened a lot of doors around here. Most Angara still keep their distance, though. Yeah, you stick out. <laughs> well, you are a bit of an eyesore. Speak for yourself. When I saw my first human, I couldn't understand how you keep your blood inside. Skin that thin. Okay. What's this? Uh, the res resistance need volunteers. Welcome to the Tavatan. Feel free to order a drink, or if you're hungry, we have nutrient paste. Not as exciting as fresh fruit, but you'll like it. Uh, what's the nutrient paste all about? What's in that stuff? In short, everything. Nearly all the food we grow goes straight into processing. Oh, wow. We can feed an entire planet in a single harvest. Wow. Even ship some off-world. If we used your system, we'd never have a food shortage. If you want, I can send a few samples to your ship. Your people can study it. The Nexus would love that. Consider it done. What does Tavitan mean? My translator won't pick it up. It depends on the context. If it's a person, it means an old friend. If it's a location, like this, it's more... a place you could bring someone home to. What if you need to meet your Tavitan at the Tavitan? It's not so hard to understand. I'm sure your language has its quirks. Yeah. Don't get me started. <laughs> yeah, English can be fucky at times. I'd like a drink. All right. See That's all for now. We'll come back anytime. Make sure those two don't give you any trouble. Join our fight? Already have, basically. Uh, are you at war with each other, it seems like? Oh, they're talking about the Exiles. Uh, we have much to learn. I believe in our future. It's forward at all. Ryder, you are the subject of a detailed scan by an Angara standing nearby. Maybe Hello. I should introduce myself. Hello there. I'm working. You scanned me pretty hard. That wasn't your way of saying welcome, stranger. I wanted to be discreet. Noted. What's your interest in me? You're an alien on my homeworld. Why wouldn't I be interested? You could have asked. Fine. Will you submit to a full spectrum analysis of your biology? Uh, well, first, what's your name? <clears throat> you haven't even told me your name. Darn Fred. Biological researcher. This is my home. Are you looking for something specific? We share many external similarities. I want to learn if that holds true internally. I have a scanner too. Seems only fair you let me go first. That's ridiculous. It's my final offer. You're bold, Pathfinder. All right, scan me. I'm Garin skeletal structure. Muscular formation and organs are optimal for thriving in harsh environments. As previously discovered, they can also generate and discharge bioelectrical energy. All done. You're interesting. So are you. When we face extinction, family is our final comfort. Do you understand that? I came to this galaxy with my family. I lost my father on the day I arrived. But you still carry on his legacy. He knew that, in the end. Family is everything. Not only the one we have now, but the ones that follow us. What will your family look like in five generations? Ten? How many of you will there be? You're worried there'll be more of us than you. 
I have 23 grandchildren. Ugh. I want to know what their grandchildren will inherit. Goodbye, Pathfinder. Uh, probably not a human species rate that large. <laughs> Oh my god, 23 grandchildren. Fuck that. Oh my god. I mean, because that just makes you wonder how many children did she have? I understand that they kind of like share the whole family with the community, but still. That's a massive family. <laughs> One sister I have, I can't stand, so. Alright, let's, let's go head off to the wall now. anyone here in over 20 years. There's always been an active display for Aya, but we could never affect it. Let's see what we can do. Sam? Yes, this is new. Is it similar to the vault on Eos? Tell me, what are you seeing? If I'm seeing what I think I'm seeing, I've got goosebumps. Tell me, what do you see? The vaults. They're a network, as you discovered. However... They're not connected to each other, but to this place. This image was on a relic the Archon showed me. He called it Meridian. And it looks like Aya's vault is the only one that's fully connected to it. And it's terraforming, doing what it was meant to do. The vault on Eos is also present, but changed. Our interfacing with it has affected its connection. What do you think, Professor? I think that Meridian is the control center for all the vaults. Thank you. This is unbelievable. If we can get to Meridian, maybe we can turn everything on from there. Make Helios live. Wait, Ryder. The Archon knows where it is. He's already been there. What? Where, Meridian? Of course. That's why he tortured me. He thought I could help him use it. Because he can't. Meridian is my people's best chance for survival. We have to take it from him. Agreed. Such power in the hands of such evil could mean the end of your people. And mine. No one is safe as long as he's on this hunt. I'm going to shut it down. For all our sakes. You're going to need that relic I saw. The Resistance might have intel on the whereabouts of Archon's ship. I'll talk to Ephra and secure his full cooperation. Meet me there. Okay, seems like we've got plenty of work to do. Oh, there's a fast travel station on this planet? Okay. I don't really see the need to go that far. We can just run there. Through the market, all the way to the back. Excuse me, pardon me. 
round the bend. Oh, that's right, that's the lady who scanned us. I deserve to be told. You had no right to keep it secret from me. It's an ongoing investigation. I meant no disrespect. Did Jal know? Of course not. Neither did the human. I could have kept Sam to myself, you know. This is different. Not your business. It is now. We need to find the Ket command ship. Tell her the truth about my capture. Moshai, please. It may be our only route to the Archon. One of my men helped the Ket take her. Really? A resistance commander named Venterev. One of your own gave her to the Archon? <laughs> no wonder you hushed it up. This isn't about hiding the truth. I'm working to capture him. Make him answer for what he did. You know where he is? Kadar report. My contacts are hunting him. Contacts? You can't trust anyone there. They deserted our cause, our people. And now they're ruled by exiles from your galaxy. Ven may know how to find the Archon and his ship. We can't leave this to a pack of renegades and outlaws. I'm a little new to the galaxy. Where did Ven go exactly? Kadara Port is a trading outpost. We abandoned it when the Ket invaded. Some of us went back. Deserters, scavengers. They don't support Aya. How did exiles from the Nexus wind up there? Bad luck for everyone. Alright, I'll check it out. I need the relic that leads to Meridian, and I can handle my people. Let me do this. I don't like it. I don't care. The Pathfinder is right. I'll transmit my files on Kadara Port to your ship. Our traitor could have useful information. We need him alive. That's up to him. Be safe, Pathfinder. As for you, Ephra, we're not done. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Somebody's about to get their ass whooped. All right, so before we even head to Gadara to find him, still want to hit up Eos in the Nexus. And I want to, um... Uh-oh, there's something up there. And I want to go to um, Havaro first, especially to help with Jal's quest. First, let's see what this side mission up here is. Hello, everybody. You want to speak with me? When Pathfinder, this is a tremendous honor. I must express my admiration for all you've done. Crossing the void between galaxies, navigating the Scourge to find Aya. Incredible. The odds were against us, that's for sure. Yet here we are, strangers from different galaxies conversing in friendship. Extraordinary. I am Mariko Darej, Chief Voneron. A Voneron? That's very... I don't know what. <laughs> ah, linguistics, not my strength. I am a celestial observer, charting the movements of stars, planets, and the Scourge. An astronomer. An astronomer. You know the safe routes out there? We deploy satellites that alert us to new hazards and opportunities. But we've lost contact with several key observers. They've simply stopped. I sent a vessel to scan their last known locations, but nothing's been found. Your Tempest is highly advanced. I hoped you could aid our search. Of course. Even Pathfinders need a good map. I'll look into it. I knew you'd understand. I'll provide search nav points. And when I can finally reconcile our charts with fresh satellite data, I'll gladly share all we have. All right, sounds good. Thanks, buddy. Oh yeah, that's right. Certain fields like cartography and star mapping are probably something that's come way back into full swing now.
Director Tan, good news. The Angara opened an embassy for us on Aya. That is... a surprise? What are their expectations? They survived the Scourge and the Cat and rebuilt their civilization. Don't forget it. Appeal to their pride. Sensible. I will gather envoys and send them to Aya. Thank you, Pathfinder. We'll take it from here. Okay, sounds good. Oh, God, going the wrong way. It's all this then. Joel's not in here. What you doing, PB? You again. Want to hear more about my childhood log cabin? You really won't tell me what you're working on? That's right. Next question. Okay. Um, you said you came with someone special. You mentioned you came to Andromeda with someone. Nothing gets by you. Guess that's why you're the Pathfinder. Just a friend. Now she's not even that. It's better to venture into the unknown without restraints or entanglements, don't you think? Sounds real lonely. I don't know. Don't friends and loved ones make all the effort worthwhile? I've always been self-motivated. Don't need much more than curiosity to drive me forward. Okay. How do you like the crew? How are you getting along with the team? I'm keeping it light and pleasant. Even Lexi isn't exactly what I'd expected. And Chal... I'm learning what makes him tick. We're lucky to have an Angara with us. Asari can mate with all Milky Way species. I find myself wondering if that transcends galactic boundaries. I'm certainly not looking to reproduce anytime soon. But he seems like a good guy. What do you think? What about me? <laughs> Go for it. Are you trying to make me jealous? Maybe. Of course you are. I'll leave you to it. You're off the hook, PB. Good luck with your project. Thanks. Don't be a stranger. I'll meet you on the Nexus anyway. Vetra? Any good contacts? I thought I hated the Ket before. Then we learned about Exaltation. I can't even begin to imagine how Jal feels about this. Uh, you saw the uprising? Anyone special in your life? How'd you join the initiative? You were on the Nexus when the revolt happened? When you promise people golden worlds and all they get are wastelands and a death cloud, they riot. Huh. Some wanted to go home, some demanded answers, and a couple just wanted to stir shit up. And you? Some days I wondered if the Exiles had a point. Maybe we were conned into coming here. But why would the Initiative go to all this trouble just to screw us over? Thing about conning people, you always know something they don't. And that's why the con works. And if I'm going to pick a side, I'm picking the liars. I mean, and also the fact that this operation probably cost, like, several billion or trillion credits. You probably have work to do. We can chat later. You know where to find me. It would be different if everybody showed up and they were just in a bunch... A, a bunch of shuttles and shit, but nah, they had full-blown arcs. All right, let's head to, um, let's head to the next. I'm going to do it. I've run all the tests. It's non-toxic. So if we're going no. to live here, someone has to take the plunge and actually try to eat things. Suvi, no. Dr. Tapero, please do something. Don't do it, Suvi. You told on me. I thought we were friends. You, sir, are uninvited from all my parties. Okay. The discovery of Aya was just what we needed, Ryder. The Angaran scientists have been so generous in sharing their wisdom. It, it's been amazing. That, yeah, I agree. Don't eat the food, though, not yet. At least one of the first contact situations went well. <sighs> right? The cat. Habitat 7. I'm thankful the Angara were willing to risk working with us. I'm afraid not all of them are quite so friendly. Some give trust easily. From others, you have to earn it. I'm confident we'll get there. Uh, the science team on the Nexus, your faith. Scourge, I like you and terrifying me. I take it you work closely with the Nexus science team? I try to keep in contact with them. We discuss anything and everything we discover out here. After all, many brains are better than one. And Dr. Aridana is worth two or three at least. I work best when I have other people to bounce ideas off of. I'm still fuzzy about how we managed to see Andromeda all the way from home. 
It confused me too. I mean, the light lag would have made any data two million years out of date. Jesus. So I asked Dr. Aridana, and she told me, well, it wasn't her tech that did it. It was the guests. Really? You're kidding. Those killer robots we had in the Milky Way? Those exact ones. The initiative obtained data from an array in deep space. A Geth construct. According to Aridana, the Geth rebuilt a mass relay and turned the approach corridor into an FTL sensor. FTL sensor? So a faster-than-light telescope? They could survey Andromeda as it was? Not exactly, but it cut down the lag by... enough. We don't know why the Geth were interested in observing beyond the galaxy, though. Maybe we'll never know. Did my dad know about this? Why didn't he tell me? It's possible he didn't know. The Geth are isolationist and hostile. Using the info, even obtaining it in the first place, probably crossed a lot of boundaries. Hey, yeah, it might have been illegal, too. <laughs> I should get back to things. Sounds good. Okay. To the Nexus. I'm picking up something. Oh, wait, what? Right, to whatever this is. Getting a scan. According to that astronomer on Aya, a satellite should be here. I'm not detecting anything. If it was here, it's gone. You mean destroyed? I mean gone. Destruction would leave debris. We've got nothing. Like Let's try another nav point. Let's go to the uh, Nexus. Anything to scan here? No. Oh, we have a lot of missions here. Okay. Hey, Carrie. Free for an interview? I'd like to know more about the Angara. It's not often a first contact goes so smoothly. At least the Angara are more peaceful than the Ket. There's high hopes for this alliance. Good to see you. I guessed you'd ask about the Angara. It's a good reason to say hi. That's not... This is about history, not you and... Me and... I... I need to finish this. So, the Angara, your thoughts on the Alliance? The Angara are survivors, and they're willing to help. They'll be great allies. The Angara soldier who joined your team has a few fans already, but everyone's talking about Aya. Green plants, flowing water... Our leaders have discussed whether we should send colonists there. We can ask them, so we'll see about getting permission. If the Angara say yes, I don't see why not. I wonder who gets to make that call. The Angara don't have much of a government left. Okay, that's... Look, camera off. I need to say something. Okay. I feel like you want to get closer to me than an interview. I think I might. What about you? I want... Oh. This isn't right. It's not ethical to date an interview subject. But once the documentary's done, we could get to know each other better. I could be spoken for by then. 
I wouldn't interfere with your life. What happens with me stays with me. But if you want to share your heart, I'd like that. Once the documentary's finished. Polyamorous relationships, let's go. And I'll be patient. It'll be something to look forward to. Thank you. Just a couple more interviews and let's see what happens. Colonist registration is up since last episode, as is morale. Tan sent this for you. Inspiring, huh? Wait, what did he send? What are you doing with that ship? I wonder what my dad would think of all this. Would he have encouraged the move? Come with us if he could? He was being an ass. Does it matter? Eh, I'm probably. sure he would have. To be with you guys. Yeah, I think so too. Sid doesn't remember anything about him, but I do. I think he might have liked it here. Yeah, if he was in the military, it'd certainly be something for him to tackle. Hey, what? Oh, is that inside the cultural exchange center? And we're happy to help your guards secure their weapons. I prefer them armed for now. You understand, of course. Oh, Pathfinder, this is the head of the Angaran delegation. The one who saved the Moshai. She speaks highly of you. Call me Issa de Navarre. Welcome, Ambassador. The Angara's first formal visit will be one for the history books. I wonder what they'll say. I was just explaining to the Ambassador that armed guards aren't necessary here. Is something wrong, Ambassador? Please walk with me, Pathfinder. So much life. All different, all united. The way it could have been. 75 years ago, we were scattered, struggling to rebuild after the Scourge. Then, the Ket <coughs> arrived. Alien life. It was monumental. But then they deceived and enslaved us. So, I hope you understand my precautions. Yeah, I, d I definitely understand it. We are different, but I get it. Your people have endured much, Ambassador. I'd be cautious, too. Yet all this, your initiative, is proof there's a better way. I want to believe in this Alliance, Pathfinder. The Moshai says you're trustworthy. Please, help me trust in you. Verify what we say. I don't know what to tell you. The cat hate us, use that. We have much to offer. Verify what we say. We don't expect you to enter this Alliance blindly, Ambassador. Everything we say, you can check. You'd be that open with us? We have nothing to hide. They'll surrender their weapons to your militia, if that's satisfactory. Thank you. We won't disappoint you, Ambassador. Havoa said Jav Jaravon, Pathfinder. Welcome to Andromeda. Thank you. Okay. Actually, wait a minute. There's a quicker way to do this. Yeet! Wait, there's... Okay, so we need to meet Gil in the Vortex, PB at her apartment somewhere up here. Come on, open. The flag of Teavuni. Let's hear it. Wow, where did you find those? Never mind, don't answer that. I think they're straight from the Milky Way. Things are shaping up, Pathfinder. Resources flowing in, sleep is ready to head out. It's starting to feel like the initiative. Not quite up to the sales pitch, but getting there. Feels <laughs> good, right? I feel it, Liam. Finally getting our start. There we go. Getting our shit together. Showing the new galaxy that we have it sorted. If I keep saying it, it's true, right? It'll eventually become true, but it doesn't mean it is. Hello, Gil. Let's play some poker, buddy. So, Ryder, big news. I think I found my purpose in life. Oh, yeah? What's that? Uh, thrashing you at poker? Shall I deal? Ryder, I can read Gil's vital signs and give you an advantage during the game if you like. Let's do it. Do it. The Pathfinder has spoken. 
Were you holding out on me? You're pretty good at this. Don't act so surprised. Poker's lost me several friends over the years. The only one who still plays me is my buddy Jill. I, I know, I know, Jill and Gil. Not the type to give up, huh? Never. She'll be with me to the bitter end. Come what may. Jill's a fertility expert. Heads the initiative CRC. My only real friend. How you doing, John? I bet 50. I call. The CRC? Colonial Repopulation Committee. She's always teasing that I'm making her job harder. She says if I'm not making babies, I'm part of the problem. We have that kind of relationship. Huh. Sounds kind of disrespectful. It doesn't bother you? Nah, she's like family. Supports me unconditionally. We just ride each other like that. You should meet her. You'll see. She's amazing. Another hundred. He's nothing. I call. Oof, nice. That one's yours. Well, the winning streak's over. You beat me, Ryder, fair and square. <laughs> Guess I continue searching for my true purpose in life. In your face. I'm not gonna do that. Cards went my way. Beginner's luck. Pedal that somewhere else. You're no beginner. Jill's gonna lay into me hard when she hears you won. Bah, I'll just tell her this proves how bad a player she is. Ouch. Have fun. And thanks for the game. Okay. Now, if I'm not mistaken, we need to pick up some movies. That is, of course, if the door opens. There's a side mission. Where is that? Alright, so. Vehicle merchant. Don't need that. General merchant. Where do I get movies from? When do uh, I can get this I part of the Where do I, where do I get, um, where do I get movies from? <laughs> hey, sure. Thanks. Oh, that's right. I can't dash. I tried to dash. I know this is stupid to look. get that at any store well not any store obviously just a store I guess not okay let's look for PB oh god don't just hate when your allergies start rocking you Oh my god, am I stuck? Peter's apartment. Unlocking. Come on in. Yeah, we're on the Nexus. Hello. Ta da! My project. She is complete. She? Looks like a she to me. Just a proof of concept. I stripped out its remnant command prompts to see if I could power it up myself. It worked! Now I can build a field model with combat protocols that fights for you. Sounds good. So, uh, what do you think? You've outdone yourself, PB. Let Suvi and Gil eyeball it, then fast track the combat model for me. I'd hoped you'd be happy. Oh no, I forgot to lock the... Shit. My, my, Pelisaria. Didn't know you were still using this hole. Who's your friend? Kalinda, this is Ryder. Oh, everyone knows the human pathfinder. I meant who's your remnant friend? None of your business, Kalinda. Of course it isn't. That's what makes it so interesting. Don't be so hostile, babe. Hostility seems pretty fair. You barged in. Don't be so condescending, babe. This is PB's place, and you're trespassing. I'd say that warrants a little hostility. Now, now. I was just concerned something might have happened to my dear old friend. I'm sorry for the intrusion, Pelisaria. I'm just relieved to see you moving on. Ta-ta. I'll walk you out. Bitch. So, wanna talk about it? 
Well, Kalinda and I go way back. We joined the initiative together. For a long time, we were like family. Now we're not. When you live a thousand years, Ryder, people come and people go. Entanglements are silly. Just like places. Time to pack this one up. I'm done with it. Yeah, but I, I do care. Hey, I hope you know you can talk to me. Anytime. Aren't you a cutie? Thanks, Ryder. That's nice. I mean it. But really, the past is the past. I'm fine. Okay. Remnant VI unlocked. Sweet. Can I scan anything in here? I'll pack up my new pet and essentials. See you back on the Tempest. I guess not. That answers my questions. Sweet. Okay. I'm really pissed. Where the fuck are those movies? I want to see what that other side quest downstairs is, but we're going to figure out where those movies are. After the fact. Yeet! The offer to put me on the transfer list. Oh, also in the cultural center. Hello. Interesting place, isn't it? Full of smiles and handshakes. Not many soldiers. Even though when politicians make peace, it's we soldiers who keep it. We probably spook them. Uh, diplomacy uh, should be before the forefront. Given our situation, it's smart to show we truly come in friendship. <laughs> though in these times, you should be prepared for the alternative. But names. I know you, Pathfinder. I am Andrachnal, a Heskarl with the Resistance. A Heskarl? Centuries ago, Heskarl were special forces. We defended colonies, passing our training down via oral history. Few remember us today. I came to learn what the Milky Way knows of such things. I heard your father was part of a similar program, an N7. Tell me about N7, what he knows about it? What have you learned about the N7 program? Human soldiers who trained on exotic worlds. Arcturus, Europa, Rio de Janeiro. Huh. They learned to fight in all environments, on little food or sleep, to care for their injured, to lead. Is that accurate? Wasn't your father one of them? Yeah. He was one of the first N7s. He was proud of that, even though he didn't stay in service. Didn't stop him teaching me and my brother a few tricks. So, you carry a little of that knowledge with you, as well as your Pathfinder skills. N7 training would benefit my people. Heskal training would benefit yours. Perhaps a few war games. Show me how your skills handle the tests of a Heskal recruit. Challenge yourself and teach me. A chance to work with the Angaran best of the best? Absolutely. Excellent. I'll activate our training beacons. Finding them can be your first test. After that, I look forward to learning. I mean, at that point, you should, uh, you should see what a specter is like. Cause holy shit. Did you hear about the vortex? That you <laughs> oh, hello, dude. You guys are new. You, you're the Pathfinder. Yes, ma'am. Thank you so much for returning the Moshai to us. I'm glad I could help. Seems your people really cherish her. She is dear to us. By the way, you should know. The head of our delegation is at your cultural center. He'd be honored to speak with you. Oh, I think I've met him already. Or I'm pretty sure I've met him already. Can I help I don't you? Know. Whoa, it's the Pathfinder. It's me. You're the one who befriended these strange new people, these Angara. And now they're here, on the Nexus. How do we know we can trust them? I mean, for certain. Nothing's for certain. Yeah, nothing is, is certain. But they trust us now, Kasorda. Remember, we're the strangers. This is their home, and they've welcomed us. They've earned our trust. I guess. Talk to them. Get to know them. See for yourself. Good advice. I will. Yeah, they're nice people. Alright. We better be able to find the movie somewhere in operations. Species are at odds as talks break down. 
down over a unified curriculum for initiative kids. The Asari say they'll wait it out until demands are met. Sounds like what the Asari did with the Reapers. They're just this like, yeah, fuck it. We're gonna, we're gonna sit this one out. Until Thessia is being utterly destroyed. Alright, what is this? Library of movies. For a strike, can't do that until it wants me to, or allows me to fucking connect. Got the movies, return to the Tempest. Okay, all right. Well, sorry that you caught me on the tail end there, John, but I thank you for joining. And if you haven't already, please drop me a follow. If anybody's watching this on YouTube, uh, on YouTube, please like, comment, subscribe, all of that. And tomorrow we'll be right back here, same time, with more Mass Effect Andromeda. So I thank you so much, and I see you tomorrow. Mm -hmm.